Crazy Maze Creations, LLC. Come on in. Welcome to the Crafting Coaches Corner Wednesday night marathon. I'm just trying to find myself here. Um, trying to find the live. There we go. Perfect. Awesome. All right, you guys, we have been so excited for tonight. Super excited. I can't even tell you how excited we are. So stinking excited. So come on in, guys. Say hello. If you guys are on my Facebook or you're on my YouTube page and you have a comment or you have something you want to say, you want to say hello to me, jump on over to the Crafting Coaches Corner here on Facebook and I'll be able to see your comments, okay? Um, you guys know what to do. Spread the love. I will give you the word of the day towards the end of the live. Um, what else? We got Carol McHugh here. Tracy's here. Hey, Jeanette Boo Boo. What's going on, girl? Um, we got Janice. Lisa Lisa in the house. Lisa Lisa in the house. Hey, Carol Ann Jones. How are you? So, Teeny's here. Okay, so I'm so excited. I just hung up with some of the coaches just now. Hey, Terry, we're so stinking excited for Kathy Kirkland for tonight's announcement. Oh, I can't wait. Like, I like if you guys know me, it takes every bit of energy out of me to zip these lips. You know what I'm saying? And um, I feel like Maisie's here somewhere. And um, I'm so excited tonight. tonight. So, um, yes, I'm so excited too. Hey, Kay, how are you? May May wants to say hi, guys. All right, May May, come here. We'll say hi. Come here. Come here. Jump up. Ooh, you know, Mama's old. I can't be. I can't jump up. Jump, 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 jump. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I got you. Okay, I got you. Say hi to everyone. Ooh, hey, baby. Yeah, yeah. I love you too. I love you too. All right, say hi to all the YouTubers. Say hi to all the Facebookers. Say hi. I know twice one day. All right, I gotta put you down, baby. Okay. Because I got work to do. Mama's got work to do. There you go. Okay. So I'm excited about tonight's project. Guys, this is a simple, simple project. Um, I have this little, like, tool caddy. I got it from Target in the, what is it called? The $5 spot or whatever. I don't really know what it's called. When you first walk in, it's that red, red dot spot. I don't know. You get things for, like, $5, $3. Hey, Joanne. Hey, Ramona. Um, so we're going to work with this tonight. Okay. Um, we're going to distress it. I'm going to show you how I distress. Um, I was going to crackle it, but then I was thinking, ah, it's got to dry. It's going to take a little longer than my hour that I'm given. So, um, we're just going to distress it. It's going to look really cute though. Okay. But let's get started on it. All right. So I'm going to turn the, the camera to the overhead view. There, we got it right there. Okay. So we're going to start painting. So what we're going to do, I'm just using regular craft smart paint. Okay. Because when we distress, I want you to see the darker color underneath. But what I think we're going to do is use the black. I think we're going to do black. Okay. Yes. You guys spread the love. I appreciate that. Hey, Joanne Allen. Hey, Shonda. How are you? Thank you for spreading the love. Hey, Michelle Bush. Becky Jones in the house. Becky Jones in the house. Hey, Beck, Beck, how are you, girl? All right, I need baby wipes. So I put it on, and I just dropped my my spray water, but we'll move that over there because I don't need it right now. All right, and we're going to take a little, we'll take a, a paper plate, okay? Thank you for doing that, Becky. I appreciate you, my friend. So these are just baby wipes from Kirkland's, Okay. Take a couple of them, move them over there, move this closer. I'm going to pour a little bit of this. Let me get um, a little bit of the black paint on my plate. We don't need much of it at all. That might even be a little too much. Okay, and I'm just going to take whatever's spillage is over the top. We're going to use it. We are going to use that, and let's take that. All right. So is everyone having a fabulous day? Hey, mom. Hey, Laura Walsh. Connie McCormick. How are you? 
Hey, Max, how are you, friends? How are you? All right, so we're just using the baby wipe, and we're just going to rub it on. We're just rubbing it on just like that. Okay, we don't need a heavy coat of it. And actually, I'm going to move this plate over to this side of me so it's easier. How's everyone doing? Is everyone excited for tonight's uh, announcements? I know I am. The coaches are static. We are so excited for tonight's announcement. And I hope you guys are going to love it. I hope you guys are going to love it. So all you need is like a nice light coat, guys. We just want the black to come through um, when we paint over it. And I'm going to show you what we're going to do. Just went a little darker. Okay. And we're going to do the sides. We're going to do everything on this bad boy, okay? Hey, Bobby Brown. Welcome. You guys, if you have any questions, the coaches are on here. I don't know which ones. I know Teeny's on here. I think Toboggan. Did I see Toboggan on here? Hey, Toboggan. I think they're on here. If you have any questions about anything, um, please don't hesitate to ask the coaches. Um, guys, and also, we have that subscriber button. Facebook gave us that subscriber button, and we're super excited for that as well. We have some plans for our, our private, I don't even know what, subscriber group, I guess you would call it. Um, we have some plans for that group. So if you want to join uh, the subscriber group for the Crafting Coaches Corner, um, it's $4.99 a month. And in there, you're going to get lives. You're going to get tutorials. You're going to get a discount in all our shops. That's five shops, guys. Six designers five shops. Okay. Um, you are going to get a discount it all for four 99. Isn't that fabulous? So hit that little button by the comments and, um, has a heart in it. it's green. It looks like, um, a, uh, a diamond, a home plate diamond for baseball and, uh, has a green heart in it. I can hear your excitement. Stony stone. What does Stony say? What's the secret? Well, you're going to have to wait. So we're going to have bingo tonight, guys, also. So if you're playing bingo, please support each of the designers. Just don't show up for bingo or for the announcement tonight. Please come on and support all the designers. We would appreciate that. You know, we all work hard to get a, a project ready to show you guys. Hey, Tracy, how are you? Hey, Leanne. Hey, Judith Pace. Um, what did Stoney say? What is Toboggan saying? I'm excited. Can't you tell? <laughs> you know, Toboggan. Toboggan, you know. There's enough excitement between the other five coaches for Toboggan. He is excited, though. He really is excited. Because he's a big part of all the plans. We all are. You know, what I love about the Crafting Coaches Corner is every Sunday we have um, a meeting. We get together on a FaceTime and we have a meeting and we plan out things. We think of the future, what we want to do, how we want this page to go, what we want to do in the future for this page. And Toboggan is a huge part of it. We all are. Oh, thanks, Becky. Yeah, I'm thinking farmhouse rustic. So I had, um, you know, those two bunnies that I made with you guys from the Target spot also that I gave to the nursing home that they put on their piano and their coffee table. Well, when I saw this, I was like, oh, I could do an arrangement with this as well. So we're going to do an arrangement with this. But first, we got to get it distressed because I don't like all this this um natural wood it's not my jam <clears throat> excuse me you guys if you wouldn't mind also if you wouldn't mind um going to each of the coaches pages um we would appreciate now if it gets paint on the inside we don't care about that that's going to be covered okay um if you wouldn't mind i'm going to need a new one look at my hand my one finger is blue Hold on. Oop, I'm getting black everywhere. Hold on, hold on. Okay. And I made a good dinner tonight, guys. I made a really good dinner. 
And I can't eat it because I'm the one kicking it off tonight. But that's okay. My mom's up there eating with um with doodles. So um let's clean that black off. So if you wouldn't mind going and liking all our pages. Now, you guys, I'm from Crazy Maisie Creations LLC. If you wouldn't mind going to like and follow, I would really appreciate that. Okay. Let me get this a little darker. Uh, Stoney and Michelle are from Wilds Creek and Company. Um, Teeny is from Coastal Style, etc. Um, Rachel is from Lovey's Flowers. And Jace is from A Touch of Decor. Okay, we're going to go a little darker on the handle. Just a little. All right. So we got it all painted. Now, our next step is to wash my hands. Got to get that black off. Um, we'll have Easter leftovers for a week. <laughs> I know I still have a little bit of, hey, Rachel Boo Boo. I still have um, a little bit of ham left in my refrigerator. Um, also, guys, if you would not mind going to our YouTube channel, the Crafting Coaches Corner on YouTube, we really want to start going live on YouTube. So we have to start building it. We need more. We need a thousand subscribers. So if you wouldn't mind just going and liking and subscribing and doing us a flavor, we would appreciate it. All right. So we have all that done. Okay. Is Michelle my bell here? There's Michelle. T shells in the house. All right. I'm going to move that black paint over there. Okay. And then next, what we're going to do is I'm just going to run the hair dryer over it real quick. Okay. It's a real quick because this basically dries really fast. Okay. I'm just going to do it really, really a quick little. Hobber, knobber, lobber. All right. All right. That's enough. We're having ham sandwiches because, wait, I didn't read that whole comment. Um, hey, Judy Hunter. Because I was busy staying the rest of the deck and I can't miss the marathon tonight. Girl, priorities, Janice. Ham sandwiches, it is for the family. All right. So I'm going to take an old brush. This is an old, I don't know how old it is, but it's an old brush. I'm going to take some Vaseline Intensive Care. Okay. Just a little jar that I use for my lips. Now is part of my crafting supplies. Okay. I'm going to put it on my um, brush and I'm just going to... Put it in areas that I want to see the black, okay? Where I want to see that distress. It's going to be heavier in some areas than others. Katie, you should be proud of me. I've kept my three-day-a-week live schedule now for the past three weeks. Oh, that's awesome! Andrea Sprinkle, I'm so proud. I am proud. i got to catch you live. I'm sorry I have not been on your live, girl. But I will catch you live, I promise. Okay. It's it's always hard to keep a schedule for going live. Okay. Let me do some on the corners. How many of you, let me see hearts. How many of you have used um, Vaseline before for distressing? Hey, Pam. How are you, girl? Okay. So I'm just going around and putting Vaseline in certain areas. Oh, a lot of you. Awesome. I love that. Okay, let me see thumbs up. How many of you this is new to? You've never seen anyone use the Vaseline technique. Now, all the Vaseline does, it just it's like a barrier for your paint, you know? Wow, a lot of you still haven't seen it. That's awesome. So I'm glad I'm able to show you something new. Okay, so you always want to, like, try and um, paint a darker color um, on the bottom, on the underneath side. I have you. Oh, Carol has done it. I like to do the edges. Okay. 
You don't want to do like a whole area. <sighs> You're a busy lady. I hope you join me live. I hope so too, girl. Do me a favor. Um, Text me. You have my text number. 845-299-8674. Text me um, the link if you don't mind. Okay, girl? Okay. We're going to do the other side. Pam has never seen it. All right, girl. All right. We're going to show you something. I got a big glob of Vaseline right there. And that's too heavy. I got to get it up. Okay. I want this to be like it's worn, like it's been around the family for years. You know, that's what I want it to look like. All right. Hopefully I put enough on there. And do the top here. And we're going to put some floral foam in here. And we're going to add some flowers. This is going to be a cute piece for your kitchen island. For you, if you during the summer, your patio. It's going to be a nice spring summer um, design. All right. That's it for that. Okay. Hey, Sandra Scarpato. How are you, friends? How are you? All right. So now I'm going to turn it on its side. I'm going to get some Waverly chalk paint. This is plaster, you guys. This is my go-to. You know I love this. All right? I love the plaster. All right? And then we're going to take... This is a brush from Walmart. You know, it comes in a pack of like eight or something. You know, I'm just going to take that. I'm going to fill up our brush. And we're just going to go right across the top. Okay? Just like that. You don't have to go heavy. You don't have to... You don't have to cover it completely, you know. We want that distressed look. So it's more like feathered out on the ends and a little more, a little heavier in the middle, okay? And then we're going to come around and we're going to get a paper towel and we're going to um, take some of that off, okay? Now you want to paint in one direction. So I'm going to paint horizontally, okay? You don't want to paint up and down, across, you know. Whatever direction you choose, you want to paint in that direction. Okay. Okay. I don't think we're dry over there, but we're going to... Hopefully go like this. Can you guys see? I'm going to try and hold it up. All right. These are like quick and easy little arrangements you can make. If you're having a 4th of July party, you're having a summer barbecue, you can even use something like this and put your forks, knives, and spoons in, get little mason jars. You know, that would be cute also for the summer. If you're having a little baby shower in your backyard, and you want a farmhouse style, this is fabulous for that. All right, let's see. Oh, my comments, where'd they go? There they go. Hey, Jody, how are you? Hey, Deanna, hey, Judy. Funny girl, asking on a live. <laughs> oh, you're talking to Michelle and Stoney. They're trying to figure out if they're going to go live at their shop or at home. All right. So let's go to the other side. You guys, thank you so much for spreading the love. We appreciate it. You never know who is looking for a live right now. It's like, who can I watch that is live? I need to watch someone that's live. And they're looking for a good craft, a good, easy craft. This is something you could do with your kids as well. Hey, where's Jacers? He's driving home from work. That I know. Hey, Michelle, Becky, can I PM you? I'm having problems subscribing. Oh, okay. Becky, I'm sure it could help. Thank you for trying to subscribe. We appreciate you. 
We're super excited. We're going to come up with a schedule and everything for our uh, subscribing group. Um, we have a page already dedicated to it. Okay, I'm just going to do the edges real rough. I'm not going to do this bar yet until I'm done um, holding it because that's going to be the last thing I'm going to distress. Okay. You guys, is this a heart party? Are we having a heart party? I love a heart party. I love a heart party. Hey, Tom, 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 Tom. I know you called me today, but I had a crazy day today. I will try and call you tomorrow. I'm not promising, but um, I'm going to see my dad tomorrow. So it's just been a little hectic for me the last couple of days, but I will get back to you, friend. Okay. Maybe you could text me or leave me a message what you needed. I love a hot party. I love a hot party. I love the hot party. Um, thanks, Andrea. I appreciate you, my friends. Hey, clubbies in the house. All right, so we got our white paint on. And as you can see, it's like really kind of distressed already, but we're gonna make it a little more distressed. I need it really farmhouse chic distress. So, guys, if you want to text, if you want to know when. I'm going live here in the Crafting Coaches Corner. You'll see the number scrolling at the bottom, 845-299-8674. Um, text me the word coach, and I will let you know. You'll get on that VIP text alert system, and I will let you know all the goodies that are going on in the group. All right? So text me the word coach, and you'll get on. Hey, Gail, how are you? I need a sip of water. Have I stopped talking? I'm so sick and excited for the announcement tonight. I can't wait. Lord of day, I can't wait. All right, so let's distress this a little bit. Let me get a paper towel. Okay. Get a paper towel. I don't need my baby wipes anymore. So we can put them away. Make room on my, my little shrinking table. <laughs> hey, Dondi, how are you, friend? And don't forget, we have bingo tonight, guys. Um, oh, that's awesome. Lori found um found Andrea. Oh, I love that. See, that's what this community is all about. It's about just experiencing each, each other, you know, and finding new lives and new people that you never would have thought that we would have met before. Okay. So I'm just taking off some of that white paint. Okay. Not much. I'm just lightly going over it. Okay. And where the Vaseline is, you're going to see that black come through. Now, it's not going to look like black, black. It's going to look more grayish than anything. Okay. That's what the look I wanted. And then we're going to take a sanding block and we're going to distress it even more. Okay. Love this. Love it. Love it. Oh, I love the hearts. Thanks, guys. Okay, so now we're going to take our sanding block. Where did I do my sanding block? It's right here. Okay. Perfect. Thanks, Tom. Tom. Hey, Carol Ward. How are you, friends? All right, so I'm going to take a sanding block. This is an old, you can see. I'm sorry, I've been use, using it for, I don't know, a while now. You don't need a lot of grit on it. Because you don't want to take off all the white. Okay? You just want to lightly sand it. You just want that. See right there? That's a perfect example right there. Can you see that? I love that. That's what I love. That worn look. And where the Vaseline is, see it right there? Wherever that Vaseline is, that white paint is going to come off. I love it. And you don't have to go heavy, you know, it's not a heavy, you know, hand that you need, okay? You actually have to hold the object, because it's such a light object, a little harder than... Love it, love it. Oh, I love that. Now 
Now we're going to do the handle. Look at that. Look at that. That's where the Vaseline was. <gasps> Absolutely love this. Gary! Gary, do not miss the um, announcement, Gary, because I know you're going to want to hear the announcement, Gary, my friend. You know Gary's going to want to hear it. Okay, we're going to do the edges. All right. You see where the Vaseline was? I love that. The chunks. Look at that. I love the chunks. That's what I live for. The chunks that come off. It's like an old barn, you know, that has been weathered and aged. Love it. All right. So now we're going to do a little white on here. We don't need a lot. Just a tad bit. We're really not going to see this handle once we put our florals and everything in here. So we just need a, a, a little tiny bit. Oh, thanks, Kim, Morgan. Hey, Janice. Hey, Kathy. Hey, Laura Walsh. Jacers is here. Jacers, are you home? So we're just going to do a little bit. Okay. Turn it this way. I wonder if Jacers is going to do... um. Oh, no, Jason, I don't think is going live tonight. I think he's getting ready for his, um, I think. I could be mistaken. He might be getting ready for his uh, thing this weekend. All right, so we got it there. We're going to take a little paper towel. What did I do with that paper towel? Did I throw it out? Oh, I did. Why am I throwing it out? Okay, we're going to take that paper towel, and we're just going to rub it. Okay, and we're going to do exactly the same thing sanding it lately. All right. There we go. Look how stinking cute our little box is. So stinking cute. Is that not cute, guys? Look. So stinking cute. Look at the sides. I love it. I'm dying over here. When is the announcement? Uh, the announcement is a little later on. We have Michelle and Sony coming up after me. And then we have um, bingo. Teeny, it will be doing bingo. All right. And then um, maybe, maybe not an announcement. Yes, I think so. I think we're going to do an announcement. All right. So this is a floral block that I got. I don't know. I, honestly, I haven't bought one of these in so long. I don't even know where I got it. I'm going to say Michael's most likely. Um, it's been used. I used it on another project. So we're just going to use the rest of it. For this. Now, I'm going to be using a lot of my scraps, guys. This cost me $5. The paint, what does it cost? These paints cost, what, 97 cents or whatever. And we used how much of it? Really. So, like, this is a really inexpensive um, arrangement to make. Okay? Hold on just one second. I'm going to take a sip of water. Thank you, Cynthia. I'm all set for tonight. Just changed my clothes from work. Got dinner together while watching and settled in for some fun. Lisa Rangard, you are my cup of tea. I knew when I met you at Crafters Convention, I was like, this girl is going to be a friend of mine. All right, we're going to put some glue. I know normally we don't put hot glue because it kind of like singes it, but we're going to put hot glue on it. Oh, I don't have my, of course I don't have my, is it hot? Let's see. I, I don't know if I had my hot glue on. Oh, I did have it on. So we're just going to, hold on, let's make sure my glue stick is in there all the way. We're just going to fill it up with a lot of glue. I'm going to stick this bad boy in there. You hear it popping? That's what happens. So normally when I use floral foam, I would use um, skewers or I use floral pins. I wouldn't use hot glue. Okay, but for this, it doesn't really honestly matter. You can get this in there and just drop it it in there we go just like that and press it down hey joy slusher how are you friends all right so we have that down can you guys see that that's all in there look how stinking cute this is now we don't want to cover all this i will have some things draping over okay but i don't honestly want to cover it all so first let's start with our height okay now I really should use the other camera. 
because this might be hard for you guys to see. Hold on. Give me un momento, and we're going to switch views, okay? So you guys can see a little bit better. I just have to clean up from my live from this afternoon, okay? Hold on. We got some butterflies we're going to use. Let me switch the camera. Okay. Camera is switched. Let's move you up. If you get seasick, don't worry. We're going to work on this table right here, okay? Let me turn on a light. I got camera lights everywhere. That's one. That's two. Move the mesh from today's project. And I think this is going to work better over here for you guys. Okay. We'll move that out of the way. And we'll use the glue pot. I'm going to unhook my glue gun. Get that out of the way. We'll bring the glue pot over here. Is that a better view, guys? Can you see? Is that a lot better? Let me see hearts if that's a better view. Hey, Patricia. Hey, Heather. How are you? I love that chicken. Oh, yeah, we painted that. I finished the chicken, guys. I did that the other day. Um, we did it patriotic. So this came from Hobby Lobby, and it was galvanized, and I painted it. Yeah, it came out really cute, right? So that has to go in my shop. I haven't posted that in my shop yet. All right, how much time do we have? Oh, I got to get going. I got to get going. Okay, parody. Okay, so we're better view. Uh, better without the light. Okay, so no light. Is that better? Let me just see what it looks like. Hey, Kristen, how are you? Better without the light, guys? Okay, better without the light. All right, so let's get going. I'm going to start with my height. Okay, even though there's a bar here, it's okay to bring your floral up past it. Okay, because we want to bring, you want your eye not just to hit one point. You want it to travel when you're looking at a design. Okay, so we're going to put some glue in here, and I should really get my steel pick up here. I don't know if um, if all these can go in like that. All right. Is the view good? No, I can't see comments. I'm going to have to bring my phone over here. Phone over here. And my glue is at the perfect, perfect temperature. It's like honey right now. And it's at a great consistency. I love it. Okay. I think my phone may be in the way. Hey, Jody. Yes, better. Everyone's saying yes, better. Okay. Awesome. Closed caption is hiding the box. Closed caption. I don't have closed caption on. I don't have closed caption on. Maybe if you guys put the volume on, it usually, when you lower the volume, it usually, uh, closed caption comes on. And honestly, this does not take an, a lot of product to fill because it's a, it's a small space, you know? So it doesn't really need um, a lot of product. We're going to take this fern. Like I said, um, oh, look at my babies outside the sliding door. Oh, can you see them? Oh, no, you can't see the sliding door. These are scraps from other projects that we are using, okay? Now, we are going to strengthen this. So two reasons why you use a pick machine is to strengthen um, your stem. So, like, this is all plastic. You know, it's not a firm. You can bend it. It's not firm at all. So I want to strengthen it, so I'm going to pick it. Or to give yourself length if you needed to add a little length to your item, okay? I'm going to add this right in front. Okay. And I am going to make this where there is no front or back to this. Okay. I need my needle nose pliers. There we go. Okay. I'm going to pick this one as well. So I want this one to be a 360. And normally when you're designing, I mean, you could ask Jace this, um, Usually, uh, the box came from Target, um, and we just distressed it. We just distressed it. Um, normally, when you uh, design, you know, you worry about height and everything, but this is not one of those designs. This is just going to be like one of those pieces in your home that um, 
that, oops, turn that around. There we go. That um, it's just going to be a little filler. You know what I mean? It's not like a big grandiose item. You know, it's more of a little filler item. Okay. All right. Now we're going to add some of this boxwood in there as well. Jace is screaming. Why are you screaming, Jacers? Okay. I'm going to grab another piece. When you design, it's usually two or three times the height on your container. Yeah, well, that's not happening for me. All right? Because I'm not usual. See, listen, when I design, there are no rules, Jace, in the clubhouse. All right. I'm not a, a traditional florist like you. So I just do what I think is pretty. You know, that's what I'm doing. What I think is pretty. And that's how I design. I do that with my wreaths. You know, even when I started making wreaths and people used to say um, about you got to work in a triangle, you got to work in a triangle. I was like, why do I have to work in a triangle? Can I just do what I want to do? Yes, I understand working in a triangle is more pleasing to the eye. It helps the eye travel, you know. But there are times when I design, I don't work in in um, a triangle. You know, I just don't. Sometimes I break the rules. You are very, un you're out of the box, Jacers. Hey, Kathy, how are you? Oh, thanks, Kim. Thanks, girl. I want to use this. I think we are going to use this. So like I said, I'm using scraps. Okay. I'm going to fill in it. You don't need moss because you're not even going to be able to see inside of it. Okay. So don't even worry about the moss issue. Look how pretty that is. All right. Let's get um, a couple little flowers in here. I have these little purplish kind of flowers. Hello. Hi, baby. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Oh. How was dinner? Did my mom enjoy what I made? It wasn't good without you. Aww. Okay, so Jason's talking about two and a half times the length. Well, this stem is not even that height, but we're going to use it. My doodles, is he not a fab? He's just, he knows exactly what to say and when to say it. He just, all that in a bread basket. <laughs> Put a little bend in it. There's a, what I do with, oh, here we go. We're going to cut a few more of those little purpley guys. Hey, Mary Williams. It just not supposed to be more than two to three times high. You tell him, Carol. Hey, Janice. Hey, Casey. Casey is uh, Jace's boss. Hey, Peggy, Peggy, how are you? So let me see. Are you guys super excited for tonight's um, announcement? Do you guys have any ideas what it could be? Huh? Does anyone have any ideas? I know some people were trying to get it out of us when we went live. But let me tell you, and I'm like the that person that spills the beans. Like, it's hard for me to keep my mouth quiet you know i'm gonna tuck this guy under that bar so i want it coming on both sides just like that what do you guys think so far see it filling up hey mary joe how are you he was sweet right oh is casey here to play bingo casey are you ready to play some bingo tonight yes looking forward to hearing the announcement patty has no idea what it is Yes, you all are going to have to have a paid group. Nope, that's not it. I shouldn't even say, nope, that's not it. I shouldn't even respond. Shouldn't even respond. Okay, so we're going to stick some forward. I need one more of those. I'm going to put some on the other side as well. Guessing a new member to the coaching team. I'm not responding. I'm just reading what you guys are guessing. Lisa, Lisa. 
Lisa, Lisa. Okay, we're gonna put another piece over here. We go in this corner. I love these little kind of arrangements, you know, because not everyone can can afford a big over the top arrangement, you know. And these little ones are just like so sick and sweet, like on a patio table, you know, during a party. If you're having a barbecue, you're having a couple people over for lunch or something. Something like this is so sick and sweet. I think so. Now, Jace is probably cringing because he's probably thinking, Katie, you are not following any of the rules. I don't want that. I want white. I want to get some weight up in here. So we're going to use some of this. Um, He's probably cringing, but that's okay. Like I said, there's no rules. None. Not in the clubhouse. Uh, Casey, we may need to slip Teeny a little money under the table so she gets your name on. Doodles is great. I'm a very lucky girl. I always say that. God blessed me. He sure did bless me when I met my doodles. Absolutely. Uh, Jace, if that was the announcement, I'm out. What was the announcement? I missed it. What was the announcement? Why would Rachel Boo Boo be out? Okay, so we're going to break this. Well, actually, we could push it up. That's why I like pushers. We'll push it up and we'll shorten the, the stem. Girl, when I first married, I did arrangements in mugs for bitty tables. I love them. I love them. Someone in the hospital, you want to bring a gift to someone in the hospital? You know, these little things are so, you could even, if you wanted to, um, take like a little Dollar Tree, like one of these, um, I don't have a correct word, but like one of these that say um, home or thankful or something or home sweet home, you could put it on the front here. You could paint something like a sunflower or a daisy on the front. There's so much you could do, honestly. Hey, Janet, how are you guys? Thank you for coming in and hanging out. And spreading love. He said someone was pregnant. Lordy day. Who's pregnant? I need to know who's pregnant in our group. Because <laughs> we all know it's not me. It's not me. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. It's not me. Hey, clans, clans. Clancy's hanging out with us. Really stinking sweet. Let's put another one. I love pushers, guys. Jace, Jace, are you telling us something? <laughs> hey, Georgie, not you. Someone is someone pregos that I don't know of. Rachel says it's not her. Rachel Boo Boo is saying not her. I have only discovered the wreathing community last year. I only make wreaths for myself and my daughter. I sew custom clothes for my granddaughter, so I'm part of a large sewing community. I will say this, the wreathing community is a loving community and holds each other up. The sewing community can be cutthroat. Girl, so can the wreathing community, but we do. This group that I'm um, that I'm collaborating with, the Crafting Coaches Corner, we are very loving and we are very, um, we want to include everyone in our surroundings. You know what I mean? Um, it's not just about us. Where's my white over oh, right here? It's about everyone. And yes, this community is fabulous. I've made a lot of lifelong friends in this community for sure. And I'm very proud to be a part of it. Stinking proud. Proud. I'm about to sing. I'm proud to be an American. Now, I don't sing, but I do enjoy it. Where at least I know I'm free. And I won't forget the man who died, who gave that right to me. And I proudly stand up next to you and defend her still today. I love that. Love that. Love that. Okay, now we need little bitty flowers. Little itty bitty flowers. Where are my little itty bitty flowers? Right here. Let's try these. I'm going to do a little pink, a little yellow. It's like a little wildfire. Uh, flower garden field. How much time do I have? Oh, I got so much time. I got so much time. 15 minutes. Up next is Michelle and Stoney. They got a really cute project. Michelle showed it to me. Really stinking cute. Another farmhouse. Um, 
design. Ooh, yes, that pink just pops. Pop goes a weasel. Pop goes a weasel. Goes a weasel, goes pop. Pop, pop. Take this off of here. Jace, if you're pregnant, is the announcement. <laughs> well, the one thing I can tell you, Jace, the announcement is not uh, that Jace is pregnant. Okay? That I can confirm. Uh, Trina, we're making it tonight. You got to stay tuned. Girl, you got to stay tuned. All right. So um, up after me is Michelle and Stoney, like I said. And then we have um, Bingo, 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 Boingo. I'm going to rip that off. We don't need that. Um, and then will be the big announcement after Bingo. All right. Now we're going to grab a little. Did I bring the white out? Oh, no, the yellow right here. That's the one I want to use. This one right here. So I got these at um, the at-home store. I think they were either $2.99 or $7.99. But I love them. They're so stinking cute. Love. Okay. And then don't forget, I'm going to give you the word of the day, guys. So make sure that you have liked and followed, okay, all the coaches' pages. We have Rachel from Lovey's Flowers. We have Jace from A Touch of Decor. We have Teeny from Coastal Style, etc. We have um, myself from Crazy Maisie Creations, LLC. Oh no, they were $5.99 at home. These flowers and the pink ones were $5.99. Sorry, I was close. Hey, I'm in New York. I'm in New York. Where'd you find that? This is the culprit from your floor. Oh, was it? Did you go take the mat out? I vacuumed it up. Oh, my God. But it's got to dry. So. You're the best. All right. Well, is it supposed to rain overnight? No. I would say leave the window open, maybe, but a crack. But you know the killer could be out there. Oh, oh honey, I have to show you something. I have to show you something. Like, remind me to show you a picture. Okay. Somebody? No, no, it's of a thing. Um, Did you set my mom up with the game? Hey, Nene, how are you? No, she wanted PVC. Oh, Lord, that could be scary. It's going to be 37 tonight, so. Oh, yeah, no, we can't. Look at how cute this is. So singing cute. Now, I'm going to cut this one. Honey, can you tell me when it's five of when I have five minutes left? You guys, thank you for the hearts party. I love the hearts party. I love a hearts party. I'm going to pull that one off. Doodles is going to keep me in line with the time. I love a hearts party. I love a hearts party. You guys, this is filling out really, really nice. Really nice. And I'm going to hold it up for you guys to see. Even better, closer to the camera. Okay. I will definitely take pictures of this and of uh, the wreath I made this afternoon and post them in um, here in the Crafting Coaches Corner, you guys. Floyd showed me awesome. Yep, 8 p.m. Yay! Hey, Floyd, how are you? I got to cut that just a sketch smaller. All right. Right in there. So stinging pretty. Let me hold it up to you guys so you can see. Can you see it? Look how stinging. We're not done yet. Now, we could have put a small, cute little bow, okay? Now, I probably would go with a little yellow, most likely. 
Okay, and we could do a sweet little bow and attach it. How much time do I have? I have 10 minutes. I have 10 minutes. Or do I have, do I have that other ribbon here? Um, hold on. Let me just see. You could do something like a little more neutral if you wanted to with the flowers. But I think that's too many flowers. Or we could do black. Ooh, the black might be nice. We might do the might do a quick little bow. Let me just cut this. We're going to do a simple bow. Really simple, guys. Really simple. We're just going to make a loop. We don't want it too big. Okay. Actually, let's make it. Let's do the loop here. We can always cut our tails a little shorter if we wanted to. Yeah. Okay. Bring that forward. That tail forward. We'll just come across here. Make sure our loops are the same. And I just eyeballed. When I cut this, you saw me, I didn't even measure it. All right. Hey, Bubba. Okay, let's get a little pipe cleaner. La, 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 la. Stick it right there. Okay. Make sure everything is straight. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to just twist one time. So now we're going to take um, gonna take our black. I like a pop of black or white in a lot of designs. All right. I just think it's stinging cute. Okay. We're going to do the same thing. Okay. Hey, Brenda, how are you? You guys see what I'm doing? Sorry if I didn't um, have that other one. We're just going to come across. Oops. Just come across this side. Okay. We're going to measure. There we go. All right. Now we're going to take this one apart. I'm going to try and hold it. If I can without dropping it. Okay. Put that there. Put that there. Pull that there, and we're going to open that up. We're going to pull that pipe cleaner out, and we're going to put it right back in. Simple, simple, simple. Okay. Katie, what part of New York are you from? I'm 30 miles north of New York City, so I'm about 25 minutes from Manhattan on a good day. Okay. Bring our tails to the front. We're going to snip this off and we're going to pick it or you could use the pipe cleaner to um, wrap around. I need a um, piece of black. Okay. We're going to wrap it around just like that. Tie it in a knot, tie it in a bow, throw it over your shoulder like a continental soldier. I can't sing all the words because I don't think Facebook would like that. <laughs> I'm getting giddy because it's getting close. It's getting so stinking close to the time. And I'm so excited. All right. So we're just going to. It's five, two. Five, two. Okay, babe. Tell me when I have one minute left. One minute. Okay, we're going to pick this. Okay, we put it on the pick machine. I'm going to put a little glue. And we're going to see how we like it. If we like it, we'll keep it. If we don't like it, we'll get rid of it. All right? A quick, easy, stinking bow. All right? So let's put a little bit of glue on the tip of that. Just the tip. Only the tip, guys. Okay, right, we're going to stick it in. Just like that. Let's push it down in there. Okay, and let's cut these tails. Oops, let's go this way. All right, guys, I'm so excited. You want to know when it's one minute to yeah. seven? One minute to Wapner. One minute to Wapner. All right, guys, that is what I have for you. Tonight, let me bring you guys over this way. Hey, okay, look how stinging cute is that? Not cute, 
Now, who wouldn't like to receive that, right? As a little hostess gift, you go to someone's house for dinner, you go to visit someone in the hospital, go into a senior center, wherever. Is that not a fabulous little chocolate? And this is, I'm telling you, all scraps, Um, probably total, I probably have under $10 in this, honestly. It's probably under about $10, maybe $9 in this. This is a great filler for your shop. If you need a little, um, doing a craft show, if you need table, you need fillers, something quick to get out, get on that table. If you're doing it this weekend, those are quick. Go to Target, get those little toolbox contain caddies, and you can make yourself a whole mess of them. All right, guys, that's what I have for you. All right, come over here. Come this way. All right, so I got to give you the word of the day. All right, I made a mess here. I always make a mess when I work on Wednesdays. Um... Got to give you the word day. So if you are new and you don't know what the word day is, I give away three gift cards at the end of every month, okay? So all you have to do is when I give you the word, just text me at 845-299-8674, the word. No emojis, no this is the word of the day, just the word. And that will get your name into the bot at the end of the month to be hopefully drawn. Anytime I go live, I always give the word of the day. Um. Oh, thanks, Kim. Thanks, Kathy. Something simple and easy. Thank you, Jackie. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, Peggy Peggy. Thank you, Debbie. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Tracy. Thank you, Lois. All right. The word of the day, guys, is Daisy. D-A-I-S-Y. Daisy. Text me the word Daisy at 845-299-8674. Also, if you want to know when I go live here on the Co uh, Crafting Coaches Corner, text me the word Coach. If you want to see me on my page, Crazy Maisie Creations LLC, I love her. Um, text me the word crazy because this is Maisie. This is who the business is named after. This little peanut right here, and she is all 100% crazy. So we definitely named the business correctly, right, May May? All right, guys. She loves a paparazzi. She loves being on camera. All right, you guys. Michelle and Stony are up next. Okay, they have a cute farmhouse design. I'm gonna put her down. Okay. They're up next. Um, I don't know if they're on here. Are they ready? Michelle Stoney, are you guys ready? Oh, you know what we could have done? I didn't even think of how much time do I have? I have one minute. Look at, we could add a butterfly into our design. Wait, look, come over here. Look, 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 look. We could put, how cute would a butterfly be? It's 658. Yep. Look, look how cute a butterfly would be in here. <clears throat> We have uh, larger butterflies. So we have a little tiny butterfly. We can put a larger one right up around here. Look how sweet butterflies would look. Look, 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 look. Look how sweet. Sitting in there, right? Stinking cute. There's so much you can do. All right. Are they ready? Are they ready? They're ready. All right, guys. So I'm going to get off. Don't go anywhere. Stay right here on the Crafting Coach's Corner, okay? Because Michelle and Stoney from Wilds Creek and Company is up next. And then up after them is Bingo. All right, guys. And now we have our announcement. Woo-hoo! I'm so excited. All right, guys. Thanks for kicking it with Katie. And I will see you over on Michelle and Stoney, okay? Stay right here on the Crafting Coach's Corner. Bye, guys.